As we expect heavier rain bans from Hurricane Dorian on Wednesday, streets in the low country will soon start to flood. With expected storm surges, that will bring even more water to low-lying areas. Lance Corporal Matt Southern with the South Carolina Highway Patrol said you shouldn't even think about driving during the storm. It puts you in danger. It also puts first responders in danger. Uh, when we get to uh, winds that are sustained at tropical storm force winds, uh, we're going to secure so that we can stay safe as well. According to the National Weather Service, it only takes six inches to stall a car and 12 to physically move a vehicle. After the storm, you come out and find a roadway that's covered in water, turn around, don't drown. You could get hurt, you could get stranded, um, you could even get killed. And then you put first responders at risk also when we have to come out there and, and, and try to save you. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention reports that over half of all flooding related drownings happen when a car drives into hazardous floodwaters. In Charleston, Olivia Parsons, count on two.